Hello everyone, it's Jenny here and welcome to a new video on my channel. Now, if you haven't heard already, Morning Was Near fans were upset, confused, shocked, surprised about the recent announcement that Ogata Haruna, a 12th generation member of Morning Was Near 18, will be graduating the group in June. Now, I came across this news when I was coming home from work yesterday and I guess a lot of us fans were kind of speculating about the next graduation. If you don't know already, at the end of last year, Kudo Haruka, a 10th generation member, graduated from Morning Musume. It was a very, very sad affair, and of course, it kick-started a lot of discussions on fan forums, social media, about who was due to go next. A lot of the most popular theories was that it would be either Mizuki Fukumura, the leader of Monomizume, or it would be Ikubo Haruna, who is a 10th generation member, but she's one of the older members as well. So there was a lot of speculation that it would be either one of them two girls, but I feel like them are the two members that will be in it for the long haul. However, I was very, 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 very surprised when it was announced that Agata Haruna was going to be graduating Monomizume. Now, to be honest, the 12th generation members have been part of the lineup for approximately four years now, and it still feels like the 12th generation have only been part of this group for about five minutes. It only seems like yesterday when the announcement of the 12th generation members came out onto the internet and I remember I was in university, my last year of university at that point so it was quite a long time ago but at the same time it doesn't feel like the 12th generation have been around that long and um, so it's quite a surprise to know that one of the 12th generation members are graduating but at the same time four years is kind of one of the normal um, lengths of time that a lot of members have stayed in Morning Mizume. However, there is a part of me that wishes Ogata Haruna could have stayed a lot longer. Um, she's one of the background members, so unfortunately, being one of the backing members or one of the younger members, she doesn't get as much exposure or pushed into the front of the group compared to her older counterparts in the group, which is sad, really, because I feel like the girl has a lot of talent. Um, I think, you know, she really could have shone in the group. Um, to be honest, she's not one of my top favourite members, but I still really, really adore her as being quite awkward and shy. And she had a lot of skills that I feel like she could have implemented as an idol, but unfortunately up front are kind of rubbish when it comes to showcasing Monomizume's personalities. The problem that management has is that they focus more on the talent side of Monomizume rather than focusing on the personalities of the girls, which you can tell there is a lot of personalities within the group, but unfortunately up front, Hello Project are really bad with showcasing the girls' personality. So I think that's one of the downsides about Ogata Haruna graduating. However, I'm not overly upset that she's graduating. Now, bear in mind, I don't hate the girl. I don't dislike her. I love her to pieces. I love that she's an ice skater. That's something I always wanted to aspire to be when I was younger, but I'm not that talented enough to be an ice skater. But I feel like there's a lot of skills that Agata Haruna has that made her stand out from the lineup and I think when the 12th generation first debuted I had a lot of sights set on Agata Haruna to be one of my favourite members. I'd say she's my second favourite member out of the 12th generation just because there was so much of her personality that I loved and wanted to experience more of with her being a member of Morning Musume. But the reason that she's decided to graduate from Morning Musume is that I believe she she was doing a test to apply for a four-year, I think it's a university course, a four-year university course, but unfortunately she failed the test and has to do another test in which she goes on to a two-year course at a junior college I believe so kind of like one step down from what she wanted to do and I think because she failed the first test she's thinking okay this is my final chance to really um extend on my education and she probably thought that being an idol would distract her or take a lot of her time where she could revise and I think with her being such a young girl I think that's a very very mature decision on her part to focus on her studies and I'm very excited for her success in her education. What she's studying, I don't know, but I think it's very, very mature of any idol to say, you know what, I might have a lot more years in this group, but I want to focus on bettering my chances at a, a bigger future, because as much as being an idol is a lot of fun, there is a very, very short shelf life being an idol. And I have to say, a high percentage of idols that graduate sadly don't have as big of a career as they would like, or they rely on being an idol so much that they don't really have a backup plan 
for what they want to do in their career. So I feel like Ogata Haruna made a very, very wise and the right decision to leave Mononizume at this point in time when she could focus on her education. It will be sad to see her go, but everything happens for a reason and I feel like she's going to have a bright future ahead in her studies and to see what she wants to be as a career is very exciting to hear about. But that's my thoughts about Ogata Haruna graduating Mononizume. Probably when there's more build-up towards the graduation I will be a bit more sad because as much as the 12th generation aren't always right at the forefront apart from Miki and Maria, I do feel like they they are a nice generation together so it's quite sad to see the generation break up so soon. But that's my thoughts on Ogata Haruna's graduation. Let me know what your thoughts are down in the comments below and I'm very sorry that one of your favourite members is leaving but she's not graduating until June so we still have a, f a few more months to enjoy her as a member. I'm thinking that when she has a graduation concert I really want them to dedicate the staging lighting or whatever towards her being an ice skater. I was saying it on my Twitter that I think it would be absolutely amazing if they had like an ice rink in the middle of the Budokan and have her do like a skating routine that would be absolutely phenomenal for her to do but of course up front I keep as F so I don't think that'll happen but if they do a graduation PV for her I really want them to dedicate it to ice skating or some sort of icy kind of theme that would be so fun to do but that's my thoughts on Ogata Haruna's graduation I'm still quite I don't think I've processed the news yet that she's graduating but obviously like with any graduation it's going to sink in for me but I'm I'm, t I'm torn a little bit you know because I quite like this lineup of Morning Miss and right now and I don't really want them to to change but that's the sad thing about being an Idol fan it's constantly changing constantly refreshing itself but that's just how it works so thank you guys for watching I had a pleasure talking to you guys again and a quick update there will be some more PV reactions on my channel next week right now this week I've been working most days on in my job outside of YouTube which is a very very hard working job so I haven't really been able to make any more PV reactions however I filmed a couple last week there will be two Subaki Factory PV reactions next week alongside a new Glue Glues PV reaction I haven't managed to film it yet but I do know that it's currently that it's just been uploaded onto their YouTube channel but I will be hopefully fingers crossed filming it this weekend to have out on my channel next week because I know you guys are so excited for PV reactions and I'm also going to be recording an extra PV reaction next week um, as requested by one of you amazing viewers so keep an eye out for that there will be plenty of videos next week until I see you in my next video have a good night or day wherever you are and I'll see you in my next video bye